am Jessica's mom. My name is Susie Molina. I was diagnosed with cancer two and a half years ago. It was the hardest thing for us, hardest thing for me uh, with five kids. I had, when I was diagnosed, my little girl was only three years old. I cried, I couldn't handle it. I was just trying not to get depressed. I was just afraid of leaving my kids behind, especially my three-year-old and my husband. It was just really, really hard. I keep trying to be positive and fighting this. It's been three years. They told me I had three to four years. Um, there's no going into remission with this cancer. It is cancer in my blood, in my bone marrow, and in my bones. I have good days and I have bad days. Um, I regret being this sick with my little one. I can't do anything with her, and that's what affects me. Uh, my daughter, my Jessica, and my Marino. son have to take days off from school sometimes just to help me with my four-year-old because I can't take care of her, and it just it just bothers me because I can't cook for him like I used to before. I have really bad days when my bones ache and I just can't get out of bed. It's something you wouldn't want anybody to have. It's just really scary having cancer because you never know. She go, and I, now I know when my expiration date is and it's hard once you know you're going to die and you only have so much time to live. But I'm trying to keep positive and with the Lord's help, He's going to cure me and I'll be here for a lot of years. diagnosed when you were 14 years old. Yeah. A young little 14 year old girl going through chemo, cancer, medicine, blood transfusions, bone marrow surgery and operations and the port going into you and shots and everything. How'd that make you feel? Crazy. Like that I did something bad or like I was getting punished for something that I didn't know what I was getting punished for. Did you ever just want to give up? Yeah, a lot of times. I wanted to give up a lot. Who helped you through that? My mom and my friends. How did chemo and cancer change your life? Like, now I'm more quiet and like, I see things more differently. Like, there's more to life than just like not doing this or doing that and being just a typical teenager but there's like now my eyes are open to like more of what life is 